Hello everyone, Skater Lover 33 here as always, and welcome to Let's Play Don't Shoot the Puppy, a game on RRRR Games. And anyways, um, yes, uh, me as always, so welcome. Um, let's push start the game. The objective of this game is to not shoot the puppy, and I have done a complete play through this already and I will tell you this is quite the hard objective so just whatever kind of tricks I try to pull just um, ignore them at all costs because these people can be complete jerks plain and simple I mean you're watching this little puppy across the screen and you you're loving it now but see this right here don't move your mouse that's the one advantage to using a uh, laptop mouse is that you will not easily move it. Do not move it. Do not click. I think it's just clicking, but whatever. Do not do anything. And see, the puppy will get even more annoying. He will stop moving. And he'll just sit there. And, oh, this is so annoying, man. I swear. The, the puppy right here, he'll be like, um, at level 1 or 2, you're like, this game can't be too hard, but later on, this is only level 4, man, this game can get quite harder. And this game also can take a little while to beat. It should only take, like, if the puppy always moved full speed, like, 10 minutes tops, but this game can take upward to 20. I mean, it's ridiculous amounts of time, and it's all because this puppy right here is being a complete jerk, I swear. I mean, but either way, let's just, um do it all oh, but and there also be times like this where the puppy is going to places like eternal suffering and you will want to shoot the puppy but do not because that is the objective of this game does not matter how much the puppy will suffer leave it alone but that's enough um, talking for now let's just oh you're kidding me and that that made me shoot the first time right there. That is a ridiculous... I don't know what made me shoot. It's, now that I'm watching it, I think I, that I was such an idiot. But I don't know what could possibly make you shoot about that. It's quite the easy objective. So, I don't know. But either way, just uh, as always, let the puppy just keep going right by. And hopefully the puppy will not get in your way. So, yeah. And here's this one. Oh my god. Are you freaking serious? I forgot that that happened. But yeah, that's sort of what I was talking about. The puppy will continue to go all the way across the screen. And oh my god, this is so slow. He's just doing this on purpose, man. Well, uh, sorry, I'm, I had to scoot a little bit closer, but, well, I hope that the puppy can get a little bit more orienting. I don't know what I'm saying, but I'm hoping the puppy will stop moving this slow, because by the time it took me to adjust my computer, get my feet propped up and everything, he's only halfway across the screen, which is quite ridiculous, to be honest. And if you think that because the puppy is kind of behind the turret, well, I don't know if it shoots at him or not, but knowing this game, it probably shoots at him even though he's behind it, so I wouldn't try it. Just keep your mouth still and just don't try anything. So, here's number eight. And here is a skip level button. One of the most evil contraptions ever, because at this point I'd be like, hey, this is taking me so long, I want to skip the level. Do not skip the level. It It's not worth it because you will die instantly. So I don't see the point of, I don't know, using a skip level button. Let's see the next diabolical plan they have. This is another one. You think the puppy is trapped? No. Just, just sit there because first time I played this, I got peed off and you have to start all the way back to the beginning 
if the puppy dies just once. That's how much of a jerk game this is. So, don't trust anything they say. Just let the puppy keep on moving. And it's already five minutes in, and I've still not had any progress, really. I'm on level 9, I think 15. So, anyways, level 10. Oh, my God, the screen goes black. Just keep on playing. The first time I did this... I thought the screen froze, so I moved it, and to my surprise, it actually froze. So the second time, I moved it again, and the puppy got shot, so I'm always disoriented, because I'm not sure if the screen actually froze, or, okay, here's level 11. Just because the turret looks like it's not there does not mean it is not. Just always think that it is. Just, you can never trust games like these. I've played a couple of these in my days, and you can never trust any of these. These are pretty evil. So, yeah. Level 12. And there, this is another trick that got me. The start button is pasted on. As in, it just sits there. And... I clicked again and it shot and I'm like, but I thought I misclicked the start button. It's just another evil trick by this game designer. Do not trust it. Oh, this game has gotten me killed so many times. I mean, just the tactics they do. 13. This is when you actually might want to shoot the puppy if you were not literally serious about beating this game. I mean, just simply looking at this, the pause in the screen, it, it would make me want to kill this puppy too, but just keep on going because, I don't know, but what would really make me mad if it's, is if another counter showed up as soon as he was about to cross the sign. That would really pee me off, so, good thing they didn't do that, but either way, just waiting for him to cross the finish line again, and we are done. Level 14 is uh, that simple. Oh, what? And even though he's sleeping, apparently. What? Oh my god, are you serious? Come on. I did not remember this level either, but oh my god. There's so many things I have to say about this. First of all, the fact that this puppy is already halfway there before he stops. So this is one and a half times to travel. <laughs> oh, that is so cute, though. I can't be angry at that. Ah, uh, I swear. But either way, let's continue on after this very short level, I hope. And we are going to continue on with level... 15 ready to start and this is the last level in the game oh my god what are you serious this is the most annoying I've ever seen the game designers get ever like I've seen a bunch of stuff but this is ridiculous. This is the point at which I, on my fourth attempt through, I think it was, got mad and shot the puppy anyway. And I, I really wish I didn't because I think, if I'm not mistaken, this is the last level. And it looks like he's just dumping up and freaking down, but don't trust him. He is actually moving really slowly. And this, yeah, I'm, I'm saying, it, like, about that point, I shot the freaking puppy. He, he can get really annoying sometimes. Okay, good. And I actually, one, don't shoot the puppy. So, now I'm going to show you what happens if you shoot the puppy. If you move your mouse, you shoot the puppy. And... One question I've always been asking myself right now is um, the 
one where he goes behind the turret does it actually shoot the puppy because I do not know the answer to this and I'm really wondering if it does shoot the puppy because you can never be too sure so let's um, look at it and this is what I hate this is what I hate and level four and he stops and I'm acting like I'm doing the LP again but I'm not I'm just waiting to get to that one level because compared to the other levels these are the fastest these me once you pass the game this game seems at the first four or five levels to be the fastest game ever like this seems like you're just breezing through it after the first attempt even though it seems so monotonously slow and oh wait it's after level five but yes um, you do want to it's like you should I save the puppy from eternal suffering I don't think so I've only have a couple of things I want to save him from and this is not one of them because I had to prioritize here so what well it's been the LP shoot god dang puppy yeah, yeah that's right puppy I'm shooting you but anyways um that's the end I never got to see if he um died when behind the turret but Oh well, look at that time too. That's the most impressive time I've ever seen. Time spent not shooting the puppy one second. I have beaten the game officially now for my second time. But <laughs> after just messing around there, I think I will end off the LP. Um, if you like this LP, I don't know. Please leave a comment or something. I'm not sure. And rate it. I, you can tell I haven't done this before. But anyways, um, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys later. Bye.